Hi guys, this is Shuman from ASC Technical. Today I'm going to show you how to fix slow boot problem in Windows 10. There are several reasons that could cause this to happen. Among of them, four main reasons are number one, it could be because of malware and spyware. Number two, because of Windows startup programs and your personal apps that are running in the background. This is one of the most common reasons behind slow down your computer's boot. Number three, because of unnecessary fragmented files in your hard disk when you need to be defragment your hard disk manually. Number four, incorrect BIOS settings. If your computer's BIOS is not configured properly, it could affect your PC startup process. In that case, you need to make sure that the first boot device is set to your primary hard disk. However, don't worry, here's some best solution for this problem. And also, this video's fourth method will help you to defragment your PC's hard drive that can definitely help your computer to run more efficiently. Keep your antivirus program up to date and check the security and health of your device. At first, you must make sure that your Windows 10 is updated. If not updated, then at first run Windows Update and confirm. After that, go to Windows Security Settings. Next, you must make sure that there is no issue in these protection areas. If you see any red X mark or yellow exclamation mark on these protection areas, then at first you will need to fix and clear that issue by going to troubleshoot option and make sure please do not ignore that issue. Next go to virus and threat protection. Now just scan your computer's hard disk to remove malware and spyware. You can select your scan type from here as you can see. After fully scanned, if detect or found any threats, then just go to threat history and just remove that harmful threat from your computer as soon as possible. After that, just restart your computer. Configure system startup. At first, go to Windows search box. Now type here msconfig and hit enter. Next go to boot tab. Now you need to set the system setup time to display list of your operating systems. Note if you have single boot on your PC then set the time on 0 second and if you have dual boot on your PC then set the time between 5 to 10 seconds. My PC has dual boot so I just set it on 5 seconds. Now click on apply and then ok. Now just shut down your computer, wait for a few seconds and then turn the PC back on. After that hopefully your problem will be solved. Optimize Windows startup programs and apps. Go to Windows Task Manager. Then you will see the last BIOS time of your computer. Generally, it records as a boot time. If your PC's last BIOS time is some number less than 10 seconds, then fine. And if you see the last BIOS time over 25 to 30 seconds, that means something wrong and its two main reasons are management engine security issue and one of the most common cause is Windows startup programs and your personal apps that are running in the background. In order to fix this issue, you will need to manually disable some unnecessary Windows startup programs and your personal apps that slow down your computer's boot. Now just select your unnecessary programs and apps. Next, just disable by right clicking on that, as you can see. But highly recommendation is disable your unnecessary startup programs and apps by using a base third party PC optimizer software, such as Preforms CCleaner. Because Windows have set some limitation to their program, although status shows here that all your selected startup programs and apps are now disabled. But you will need to disable some extra programs and apps manually that are not showing up here. 
and please note very carefully although highly recommendation is optimizing your pc by using a best third party pc optimizer software like periforms ccleaner but i will not recommend you to do that due to some security reasons though microsoft have not found any security issues in the latest version of ccleaner if you want you can read more about periform ccleaner from internet however if you want then you can follow me just for education purpose and keep in mind that do at your own risk. At first you need to download Pdform Cleaner by googling. I have already installed so I just open it. Next go to tools options and then select startup. Then you will see the Windows Startup programs and your personal apps. Now just select your unnecessary programs and apps. Next just click on Disable. And also you can use your laptop manufacturer's optimizer software. So go and check out your laptop manufacturer's website if they provide that software. If you have an Acer laptop then just follow me to download. At first go to Google and search for Acer Care Center. Now just download the Acer Care Center software according to your operating system. I have already installed so I just open it. Next click on Tune Up. Next go to Startup Applications tab. As you can see status shows that boot time impact medium. If you want to use very first boot PC, now just select your unnecessary programs and apps and set the application's priority order disable as you can see. Next just click on optimize. After that as you can see status shows that boot time impact low. Now just close all tabs and just shut down your computer. Wait for a few seconds and then turn the PC back on. As you can see the boot was very fast it took like 5 to 10 seconds for the user visuals to appear although this pc has dual boot all right now let's see the exact bios time or boot time of this computer as you can see it was really very fast boot disk defragmentation at first, click on Start menu icon. Next, scroll down and open Windows Administrative Utility folder. Next, click on Defragment and Optimize Device Utility. To see the fragmented files in your hard disk, just select all the drive and next click on Analyze.
After complete the process, if all device current status shows 0% fragmented, then no problem. And if current status shows some percentage of fragmented data, then just click on Optimize All to defragment your hard drive. Note, defragment your hard drive will organize all fragmented data. This process could take several hours depending on the condition of your hard disk but it is recommended defragment on a regular basis. And one more very important thing, it is highly recommended that defragment a hard disk using a best third party disk optimizer software such as Piriform's Defragner. If you want, you can download this software from Piriform's official site. I have already installed so let me give you a look of its graphical user interface. To see the fragmented files in your hard disk, just select all the drive and next click on analyze. After complete the process, if current status shows some percentage of fragmented data, then just click on defragment. It will help to organize all fragmented or disorganized files on your computer's hard disk. Note, this process could take several hours but it is recommended defragment on a regular basis. After completing this process, as you can see, all device current fragmentation status shows 0%. Now close the defigler and shut down your computer. Wait for a few seconds and then turn your PC back on. After that, hopefully your problem will be solved. We hope you will like. Of course, let us know your opinion. If you have any questions, then please let us know. Please like, comment and share. We need your support. And guys, please don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.